Борщ суп ресипи from Martha Stewart. Don't betray my faith in you. Faith, Martha. Borscht is Polish for beet soup. You just started the new war, Martha. Borscht is the Polish traditional soup. Let's go. Let's go, bleh. And my mom's recipe is utterly fantastic. You can make it with or without meat, and during Lent we always made it with vegetable stock. Borscht is not necessary to do with meat. No, it is necessary. You are vegan. This road is closed for you. You are a Slav, or you are a vegan, bleh. You have to fry onions on the bacon. Do you know how to call a vegan borscht? Western spy, bleh. I love borscht. Flat plate. Martha Stewart, maybe you don't know Slavic cuisine, okay? Do you know soup? You have a kilo of sour cream in here, блядь. Is it enough for you, Martha Stewart? We didn't even start, Martha Stewart. I hate you already. I love borscht, whether it's hot or served cold. With... 18 seconds. We can start. What do you mean served cold? Comrade, the borscht is a hot. Suka soup. In a bowl with meat. If you serve something liquid, meatless, and cold in the flat plate, you are not allowed to kitchen. The first thing you always have to do, as my mom taught me, is prepare the beets. And so what we're doing is roasting them. It's real easy. That, that's right. Your mom is a wise woman. First thing you need for the borscht is a beetroot. You could boil them if you'd like, but roasting them keeps in all those flavors. And what are you doing, mom? I'm peeling the last. While you are starting the wars, your mom is working. Oh, the last beat. Oh, so mom's peeling one that's already been cooked, but she. The smart woman, she is using the gloves, but the only thing, she holds the knife with a gloved hand, and she holds the beat with a suka naked hand. What a family, блять! He wanted me to show you how to do this. So, in a piece of parchment paper inside, whole building in here, a piece, piece of foil, of paper. just wrap up the beads and place them in an oven. Oh, forgot to sprinkle them with salt. Have to and why do you have the pot, блядь, if you want to bake your beads? Just sprinkle okay. them with a little bit, of course, salt and, and a, a little, little bit, bit of okay, and a little bit of pepper, right? You have to peel that bit, you know it? You just peppered your unpeeled beef before baking it. Do you like uh, sneezing? And, uh, some people put a Can little you olive stop oil it already? Inside, um, even a little bit of water, but I don't think you really have to do any of that. And then get this into a. <laughs> some people are trying to pour the water so it won't turn into cold. I don't think you need it. You need the pepper. 400 degree oven and bake until they're. 400 degree, blять. How, how hot is it? They're really tender. Well, um, you can check, check the uh, yeah. tenderness with a knife yeah. or a fork. And it takes about how long? Maybe an hour. Okay. But <laughs> um, so it's there. a less messy way of doing them than boiling them. So and now the, we grate it on the coarse side. Mom, how much time do I need to bake it? I don't know, but honestly, we will boil it after use, so I don't care. You see, I'm grating the raw beetroot, blять. Yo, baker. And so only four beets for this entire soup. This is vegetable stock, Martha. Okay. This is vegetable stock, Martha. This is vegetable stock, Martha. Okay. The... Stop it, what are you doing? We need meat stock. Carrots, Carrots. celery. Celery, so, 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 suka! I didn't know you can do so many wrong things in uh, 30 seconds. <gasps> Soviets, Slavs, don't know what the celery is. Not the celery, not the celery, blядь. In. Did you put any garlic in? Yes. No, yes, garlic. garlic. And we're going to put the recipe for mom's vegetable stock on the website. Really? You, you have to post the recipe of your vegetable stock on your website? Is it that difficult? I get it. Celery, carrot, garlic. Thank you. Make it a very piquant kind of a borscht. It's soaked um, mushrooms. So you have some um, morel and some, what, pork? Yeah, who is nice? It is the first video I turned on. It is the easy soup. Just the British suka soup, chicken soup. But instead of noodles, you place the beets. Suka, soaked mushrooms.
Why to soak mushrooms? Why to add them in the borscht? Хайя, блядь! Пучини? Пучини. Yummy. Ху! Пучини, yummy, блядь. Я пошел. I had dried Polish mushrooms. We would soak them for a couple of hours. Why didn't you bring some of those? Well, I didn't have any to tell you the truth. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. They're very, very expensive. But I think we could afford four mushrooms. They are very expensive, you know. Soviet borscht is a very expensive dish, блядь! With the rarest mushroom you can find. Truffles, truffles, and truffles. Martha, truffle. <laughs> so you want to try really hard to get... <laughs> Mom to spring for the mushrooms. <laughs> so chop the mushrooms. Yeah, I hate you. Cut them up. They've been soaking for uh, a couple Forge. of hours. You don't throw the water away, do you? No, we put it. Blech, I don't know yeah. what is it. Is it a mushroom? Blech, it's, I don't know it, even know who is it. Yeah, Should I strain it? Get Because that might be a little bit of dirt. Ach, the bottom. yop, just, I'll, I'll just, no, yeah, Okay, but. Should I strain it? Get because that might be a little bit of dirt you in the bottom. Yeah, I'll just, I'll just. The liquid she soaked her mushrooms in. Now it is the vegetable stock. You soak your mushrooms. Why? It should be at least, if not poisonous, then at least cause diarrhea, blять. If you soak something in, in the water, you don't add that water in your soup. Not pour in the last. You can see the black specks in the bottom of the bowl. Well, don't throw you those don't in because they might be earth. You see, the <laughs> garbage in my stock. Beautiful mushrooms, mushrooms, right. <laughs> All right, so the mushrooms go in. Do the beets go in? Mm -hmm. Oh, now, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we can okay. put them in now. So slide those beautiful beets right into the... Cold unsalted water. You don't have to be a slav to, to see he's doing it wrong. Cold unsalted water, blyat, and raw beetroot. Why, why? Woman, blyat, it is the worst recipe in my life of everything. Mm. This is mm. a, such a simple soup. So now this cooks, uh, what about the parsley? Yes, and... we'll add everything. Oh, okay. And a uh, clove of garlic. So this is what? Two tablespoons of chopped parsley and a third of a cup of chopped celery leaves. Hiya, blyat, you add greenery and sure. in the last second. Sure. A teaspoon. I think sugar always is very important in a soup like this. It just of course, sugar is very important in soup. It's the sugar soup. Borscht is the sugar okay, so soup. So now we cook that for about how long? Suka, what did, well, we what are, what is minutes. it, blyat? We have one that's already. Martha, are you a Western spy? Are you trying to repel people from Slavic culture? Okay, so now we cook that for about how long? Okay, well, nice. We cook it about about 20 Comrade, it's not we the borscht. All... It really does change appearance, mm -hmm. doesn't it? Oh, that looks so good. Now what happens? Well, now we add sour cream. I'll mix a tablespoon of flour, a half a cup of sour cream. It's not the chaya, it's for you, blech. To make your sour cream sauce, just add sour cream. It is the sauce. Do not mix it with the flour, blyat. Are you adding the flour to your ketchup for the french fries? Why? Why do I need it? Suka. It's not worth it to watch how they're mixing flour. For you. So this isn't thick enough for you. you. Oh, you make it pink though, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. Sour cream adds a little flavor. Now, if you want to, you can add a ladle full of um, the worst. Okay. Mmm, gorgeous. No, it's not. And does this cook a little longer? I don't know. I don't know how, comrade. She added the raw borscht in the sour cream. To make the sour cream taster, it is the sauce for the borscht. She added the raw borscht, it's not cooked. So that looks good. So add this? Yes. It isn't looking good. So that'll good. thicken the soup beautifully. Ah, mm. you are boiling so. You cream. always add the liquid to the sour cream, otherwise it'll curdle. Borscht is supposed to have a sour flavor. And over the years, I've always used sour salt, which is like citric acid. Yeah, borscht is supposed to have the sour taste that's why you add the sour su su cream not the sour salt <gasps> add tomatoes 
Tomatoes, it's the tomato soup. I mean, the beets are just for the color and for little taste. Yes, but it's the tomato soup. Add lemon. I never saw sour salt in our house ever. Well, this is an old Ellers. <laughs> It's taken this many years for my I get it. Martha also, also never saw the sour salt. Maybe your mom just learned how to use printer. Ha 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 ha! And I have it, bled. And what about the lemon juice? All of this? Well, first taste the soup. I added already just some acid, some dissolver, bled. don't have citric acid, sour from salt, breaking crystals. Bread. Oh, the lemon juice. Lemon juice. Lemon juice. Think we should add lemon? Mmm, raw beetroot, bled. Add, but I love lemon. And if you have any vegetarians in your family, or if you really are practicing Catholics and not eating any meat during practicing Lent, this who? is the best. An another way to serve borscht is mm. with... Another way to serve borscht? Another way? You are serving it already, Blade. Just the pot? So you are not tasting it, you are eating it already from the pot? A An another, another way? Another way to serve borscht is mm. with boiled Perfectly. potatoes. Another way to serve borscht is the borscht with potatoes. <gasps> Another. So the second way to serve borscht is the, the first one is with mushrooms and dissolver. WD-40, блядь, from your Polish mom. Tuka, celery, acid, borscht. It's the Slavic cuisine. If you hear something is Slavic, you add potato, блядь. You don't care. They say it's what, blad. Even the vodka is from potatoes. Taste it. Uh, I don't want to. <gasps> She's pretending. She's pretending, Marta. I think I would add the rest of the lemon juice. Okay. More, more acid. You still can see the bottom of your pot, so not enough acid. When you see your neighbors, it is At enough. At the very end, we add chopped fresh dill. Mm. Lots can, of it. And you can turn off the flame. Yeah, you have to add some greenery in soup, Martha. Just when you are adding some sort of greenery in your soup, you don't have to add all the greenery, blad. And what's always been nice about soup at Mom's is that the soup is served hot, not lukewarm. Right. Mm -hmm. So a big scoop for you. It's not the plate. Mm, what a it's color. Not the borscht. And another thing you can do is to garnish is to put a little I sour just don't cream have on top. Oh, we must. Any more now, power for it. that is the perfect oh, soup. That delicious. It's not the and soup I'll at tell all. You in Polish, smacznego. Smacznego. Meaning smacznego. very delicious. Smacznego. Danke schön, Polish mom. <laughs> now, how do you say happy Easter in Polish, mother? I Veselego, alleluia. Veselego, alleluia. What? Veselego, alleluia, blyat. Kuya bardza, mother. Proszę. And happy Easter to you, too. Try the borscht. It's happy really Easter. good. It was impossible to make it worse, but it turned out is the Easter borscht. Easter borscht, you know? X borscht. I'm so unhappy. I wish cooking shows you are still this calm and relaxed. That's not calm and bled. Martha's mom is calm. You can throw small kittens in the back in the river with the calm face. It's not the calm picture. Saki babra. It's not the borch. Govno yeb kurla mak bidlo yeba. Mushrooms, but pizdi kur. No, it's, it is enough. I'll try to find some more recipes from Martha Stewart. I need some vodka. Martha. Your mom is a nice woman, I believe. But please, never cook borscht again. It's not your best dish. You take the onion, you fry it, you add the carrots, you add the garlic, you add the beetroot, you add the potato, you fry it if you want. You add the beef and you're boiling it. It's the simplest soup ever. Mwah. No celery, no mushrooms, no acid. And... Please, blядь, put it in a bowl, not on the surface. And that's a man. And that's all for today. My name is Mark. Subscribe, comment, subscribe to our Patreon. Like and see you next time.